let's discuss the importance of finishing off your work correctly. I'm going to go ahead and finish off this round here on this granny square by slip stitching here to the corner. And if I were to finish off according to how most tutorials tell you, I would simply chain one, cut my work, pull my yarn through, and snug it up to my work. However, I promise you if you'll do your work this way, you'll have much more success. After joining chain two, not one, two. Leave yourself a nice long tail, pull your yarn through, you've got two chains here. Pinching between your thumbnail and your index finger, pinch the very top of this sequence of chains and then with your other hand pull firmly and you're going to pull that knot snug up against your work. This creates a really nice little, almost a surgical knot. That knot's not going anywhere. This is not going anywhere. Your work will not come undone. Okay? Then simply weave in your ends as you would with any other project. But this knot's not going anywhere. This is the best, most secure way to finish off your work to make sure that your beautiful project stays for generations to come. Do you have any tips that you'd like to share? I'd love to hear about them. Make sure you leave them in the comment section below. Maybe I'll use them in a future video. Okay, that's it from the craft room today. Thank you so much for joining me. Until I see you again, take care of yourself, take care of each other, and have a blessed day. Bye-bye.